Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Allah halal family Welcome to the channel I hope you guys are having yourself a wonderful uh, day In today's video we'll be reacting to Is this Jakarta? This video was suggested by brother Muhammad Thank you very much for taking the time to send me your recommendation and suggestion Stay tuned guys We'll be right back with a video Welcome back guys, inshallah we're going to get started with the video momentarily and at the end of the video I'll be sharing with you my observation and reaction so please make sure you stay until the end with that said we're going to get started with our video Jakarta, what have you heard about it anyway? Let me guess, there's nothing fun to do? Boring capital city? Air pollution, traffic jam, no outdoor activities? Is it even in your bucket list? Well, for one thing I can say that you are absolutely right but also, you are very wrong. So, Jakarta is not very popular for tourists. Do you think it's improving day by day? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very improving, I think. So, uh -huh. I think uh, now tourists can come and enjoy Jakarta because our Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and we will continue exploring Jakarta and so many people continue saying that Jakarta is a business city, it doesn't really have so many sides but I'm here to prove you wrong and show that Jakarta <laughs> is actually trying to do its best to have a lot of outdoor activities and today we are in Gebeka in order to explore some beautiful sites of Jakarta so let's get started and what I love about this place I can see a lot of benches which is an improvement for Jakarta so that people can actually sit or maybe even do the picnic on the grass and what I love the most is besides enjoying the nature we can also enjoy the view with the sky campers there also you can see a lot of cyclists cycling over there which is so amazing let's go and explore more of this beautiful Gebeka place the place where I am right now is called Gebeka, Galora Bunkarno Stadium. It is a huge stadium that has the football field, the jogging track, tennis court, huge parks, basketball hall, squash hall, places to eat, places to chill, and so on. In other words, it's a really huge area. What is really interesting that the construction of this place was partially funded through the special loan from the Soviet Union. There is an interesting fact that is related to this place. Actually, Asian Games 2018 was held in Jakarta and it was held in this stadium, in Gebeka Stadium. And the countries, like all the Asian countries, they actually came here to this place to compete with each other. And different sports such as football, basketball, wrestling, all were played in here and there were a lot of people. So this is another reason to visit this place and feel the vibe of the Asian Games 2018. <laughs> and sweating and it's a little bit sunny so the best thing about this place is that they have a shuttle bus thank god so we can ride and just look around that place you know if wow. you're a lazy person and you want to explore it while the shuttle bus you can totally do that let's go is it for free though Ini gratis pa oh it's also for free which is great usually if you go out of jakarta the traffic is horrible but if you stay in jakarta and just come to give a and ride the shuttle bus, it's the best activity ever for the weekend. We discovered this beautiful place, it's called Hutan Kota by Plataran. And I've actually seen this place in my friend's Instagram, it looks so cozy, it's like a place to eat. And I'm so excited to show you, let's go inside and see what is it there. So, to our disappointment, we cannot enter the place. Because of the safety measures, they do not accept people just walking from the street and just entering there. We apparently we have to make the reservation, so it's super sad. But I hope I can come here another day and show you more about this place because it's really cozy as far as I know and all the pictures say so. So yeah, sadness. But luckily, just around the corner, we discovered a very cozy coffee shop which was called Kadai Inn and it had a charming indoor and outdoor seat and had an access to the fascinating view of Jakarta. 
Obviously, sipping hot coffee in a sunny weather in Jakarta in such a tropical country outdoors was not the best idea. Now I totally understand why Indonesian people hang out in the malls all the time. To cool myself down, I will go to the mall right next to Gebeka, which is called Effect Sudirman, and show you what is it like there. Well, guys, right now we are inside the mall. It's pretty empty, which is great. It might sound very ironic, but yes, I'm going to Starbucks. I know I've just had a coffee, but I really want to show you what is special about this outlet of Starbucks. Out of many outlets, this one is my favorite one because it has a special view to Jakarta, which would allow you to have your sweet frappuccino in peace and watch that wonderful city glowing. And by the way, on my way out of the mall, I saw this eatery with such a cute and adorable toy cow soda to prevent social distancing and I thought that it was really sweet and enlightening. But the best highlight of the day was seeing a lot of Indonesian youth actually hanging out outdoors because all my life I kept thinking that malls are the only places where everyone, literally everyone in Indonesia hang out. There's another interesting thing that's going on. It's like, it feels like people are working out outdoors with this beautiful view. It's really amazing. And these are the things that you can actually explore in Jakarta just out of the blue. So many new things can change and evolve over years in a specific city. And you might be residing somewhere for a very long time and yet skipping some fun, exciting and new things that has started happening there. And as this slogan in Jakarta Center says, Fun. That is why get out, explore some new sites, live in a moment and remember that little things make big days. So guys, I hope this video will inspire you to love Jakarta even more. There are so many beautiful places in Jakarta that I would love to show you in my videos. Make sure to subscribe to Like the video and goodbye. See you in my next video. Wow, guys, thank you very much for suggesting this video. This was awesome. You know, we've seen Jakarta, for example, with the drone shots and a little bit here and there, but you don't really get to see like those little areas of the city. And this was like a perfect video because, you know, it gives you a good idea of, you know, where every little area is within, for example, Jakarta and get a little bit view of the mall, the coffee shop, Starbucks, the stadium. So thank you, thank you, thank you very much guys for suggesting this video because you know it actually gives you like a, a first person point of view of the city and how to get around and what it looks like. For example, the locals are skateboarding, people are walking and jogging, riding their bicycles. So that was really, really nice to see because inshallah it'll be nice one day to experience it. Maybe, you know, you never know. Um, Travel Indonesia might want to sponsor me and send me to Indonesia to check it out. You know, you never know if they're watching it hit me up guys if not inshallah once the channel hits uh, a million subscribers we'll be making our way over to indonesia and we'll be checking out these beautiful uh cities as well as the mall so thank you very much guys for suggesting this video i hope you guys enjoyed it as much as i did if you did please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and if you'd like me to react to another video please put in the comment section below as always guys thank you very much for your love and support i hope you guys have yourself a wonderful day take care of yourself and your family and inshallah i'll see you guys in the next video take care wassalam